So I saw this question on Reddit and I'm going to give my answer here and I'll share it, but credit goes to this question goes to Reddit. So somebody had asked, what do you think would have happened with the sister wives if Robin, if they hadn't moved to Vegas? So to remind you, Robin was living several hours away. The OG wives, Mary, Janelle, and Christine had a house that each had separate living places that were connected, sort of Janelle on one side, Christine kind of on the other, and then Mary shared the upper floor kind of between them. And so you could you could go through Mary's to get to the other, which was this whole big thing. But then Robin moved, and she got, it looked like she was running a house or maybe a townhome that um, uh, was about a mile away. Now, I will point out that she had repeatedly through season one and two talked about being nervous about like when they'd go on vacation, like sharing kitchens and and all of that. But what would have happened if they had done it long term? Would it have been the three wives? And Cody really wanted to get her into the house, but she was like, well, it's inappropriate because I'm married and she seemed I wasn't married to him yet. And Oh, then I wouldn't want to take someone's place. So it's kind of an ongoing thing. And then, of course, when they moved to Vegas, they had no choice but get to four separate houses. And they eventually ended up in four separate houses in a cul-de-sac. And they eventually ended up with four separate houses in Flagstaff and they, so on and so forth. But what is your thought about if they had stayed there? what would have happened with their living situations. I believe that Robin did not want to share a single house, and so they would have ended up where she could not stay in a single house. I think Cody was ready to move. I do think that the the investigation was a convenient reason to move, but I think he kind of had the itch to go and he was going to go. And I think she would have fought and successfully fought because she's very sneaky Um this idea of, of having to share a kitchen or a house with other people. That's my opinion. And, you know, she was, she's always been really good at saying the right things. You know, she, on her Pinterest board, someone found that she had that quote from my big fat Greek wedding. That's like the man is the head, but the woman's the neck. And I think she is excels at having at saying things in a way so that Cody thinks they're his decisions and that he's the ruler of the household and she's this nice submissive wife but I but I think that she has her own ways of doing it which many women have done for centuries and generations but you know everybody else in the relationship was being pretty upfront and I think she's always been a little sneakier so I think I do not think they would have ended up in one big house anywhere because I don't think she wants it I think she would have figured out a way where it just wouldn't work. Um, and I think they probably likely would have moved regardless because I think Cody was eager to move. So that's my opinion, but you tell me yours.